Hi Pisces, welcome back to my channel. You need to know this is going to be your new love messages. All right, if you're new, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe, and all that. All right, personal reading that information is down in the description box. So this is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right, new love. What's new love messages for Pisces? What is the new love messages for Piscean, please? Pisces, new love messages for Pisces, please. New love for Pisces. Pisces, what's the new love messages for Pisces, please? We have the King of Pentacles, so Big Daddy is in the building. Could be a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. This could be a business owner or a millionaire, or this could be a promotion in the job. He has Six of Cups. So this is someone from your past, more than likely. All right, so with the Six of Cups coming out, this um, soon could tell me that everything that is about to be to come out here could have already happened here. All right, but there's a King of Pentacles from your past. This could be a husband or whoever. You have the Temperance. Somebody wants to um, to reconcile something here with you. This could be a Sagittarius. Okay. All right, we have the moon card here, Cancer energy, and the Six of Swords. With the Palace of Wands. Yeah. And the Page of Pentacles. So, yeah. There could be... So maybe you left or maybe you broke up with the, uh, the Empress and the Queen of Pentacles. So there could definitely be a family here or a marriage. The King to the Queen of Pentacles is here with the Empress. That somebody could be pregnant. So this could be somebody from your past here, Pisces, that wants to come in or get married or they want to work on the marriage or something. Yeah, Nine of Swords, Nine of Pentacles. You guys could already have a child and somebody could be pregnant. Or something. What's this new love for Pisces? New love. There's definitely children involved with the with the Six of Cups here and the Page of Pentacles. Yeah, the Tower, Scorpio energy in the death. Something is over in the justice. All right. So this could be a divorce here, but somebody because maybe somebody has a mistress here with the Empress that they got pregnant, and this is it's a secret here with the Moon card. But it was revealed with the tower. So, yeah. What's the Empress? Yeah, the Six of Pentacles. This is definitely also be child support. So, somebody's having to pay out child support here as well. In the world. Yeah, we have the death, the tower, and the world. So, something is over here. Most definitely. This could be a divorce that's being finalized after a long time here. What's the Empress card? What's the Empress? The Four of Swords. And the Tree of Life. So, yeah, what's the... Yikes. I feel like... What, what is that? The Empress with this, with this. Yeah, the Queen of Swords. Definitely could be dealing with a Libra. It doesn't have to be. Because the Justice and the Queen of Swords is here. As I feel like somebody here. Yeah, Seven of Swords and the Devil. And the King of Cups. So there's somebody here emotionally manipulative here. I feel like there's a, yeah, there was a, a, a um, pregnancy here. There's a pregnancy outside of marriage here, and there's divorce happening. Because of that, I feel like somebody, Queen of Pentacles, is married, and there's also a, a Queen of Swords some fucking where. And now we have the Queen of Cups. So somebody is just moving around. What is all these queens? Yeah, somebody's facing some karma here. All right. I feel like all this already happened in the past. All right, this don't have nothing to do with the new because the past, because this something blew up just recently or something is about to. There is a marriage where somebody lied about being married. They're a liar. They're a con. Okay. They got somebody pregnant outside of their marriage. This could be somebody younger or somebody at a distance from them with the world card and the six of swords. All right. 
And then there's a Libra somewhere too that has something to do with what's this Libra? What's the Queen of Swords doing? What is the Queen of Swords doing? So somebody betrayed and backstabbed a Libra here. Okay. Yeah. So somebody, what is the Queen of Swords? Three of Cups. What is the Queen of Swords? The Sun. What is the Queen of Swords? Yeah, somebody definitely. Okay, so we have three Libra out four times. The Queen of Swords clarify itself with the Three of Swords and the Two of Swords, which is Libra. All right, and the Justice is here. So somebody betray and the Empress. So we have Libra one, two, three, four, five, five times. Every card of Libra is out here. So a Libra is significant. So somebody um, is divorcing there. There's a Libra or that somebody betray over here. Okay, with the three of cups in the sun, they may want to try to come back in and reconcile. Or somebody's haunted. Yeah, somebody's haunted. What's the eight of swords? Yeah, they want to apologize to this Libra. Yeah, the lovers. The Knight of Wands and the Six of Wands. So somebody here is in the in the public eye or highly celebrated. Yeah. And somebody here, I mean, this person is in love with this. They, it, there's a deep connection with this Libra, but something went hey right here. Somebody lied. There was cheating. There was betrayal. And there was backstabbing here. A lot of secrets. And I feel like somebody is stuck on what they did here. Somebody's facing a lot of fucking karma. I'm talking about big time. Okay, so somebody lied about being married. Then they got, the, the marriage is over with the death, the tower, and the world. Now they're going towards somebody else because uh, a Libra found out something. Now they're moving towards somebody else new that they met here. But that's going to fall apart. Okay. With the death, the tower, and the world. Somebody also got somebody pregnant here. Yeah. Yeah. What's this pregnancy and this new person? Yeah, the strength card in reverse, the hermit, the eight of cups, and the three of pentacles. Um, somebody's going through, going to go through a dark night of the soul here. After they face all this karma that they're going to be facing here. Yeah, somebody's going to go travel and want a relationship with this person. This person at a distance that they're stalking. They want a new beginning with this person. They feel like this person is the one. Yeah, new beginning, the fool. But I just get a feeling, this definitely is somebody younger here. I just get a feeling that something's going to go haywire here. Like, seriously. Yeah, Page of Swords. Something is not... Okay, what's the king to the queen of pentacles? So something is not a... Uh, yeah, ten of wands. The marriage is a burden here. Okay. Tens represent completion, so there's definitely a divorce or something going on here. All right, but yeah, somebody wants to go. I feel like with the Eight of Pentacles, with this new love here, Pisces, just be careful because I feel like something is 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 going to like fall apart abruptly here. Some, somebody's facing a lot of karma. We have the star card keep wanting to pop out over here on this Libra side. So somebody could be a star over here. Okay. Yeah.
somebody definitely is going towards a new beginning here with somebody else that they got pregnant with this mistress that they got pregnant that they're stalking and watching and obsessed with like literally they want they're going to go towards that person they're going to start a new somebody can even be moving across the country There was a deep, deep connection here with a Libra I'm getting. All right. Could have been a twin flame or something. But somebody betrayed that person and then somebody um, lied and betrayed their wife if they were in a marriage or a long-term commitment. And they're going to leave behind everything to go towards something new and much easier to deal with. All right. So let's get the messages for... Pisces, Pisces, somebody's facing a lot of karma though, a lot, with the will of fortune, the justice, what goes around comes around, what's the messages for Pisces, what's the messages for Pisces, what's the messages for Pisces, Pisces, what's the messages for Pisces? What's the messages for Pisces, please? We have deception and keeping open mind. Someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship and your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expect expectations. So we have... Uh, one more so yeah somebody could be wearing a false mask yeah we have attraction here okay and codependency and stay optimistic about your love life so i feel like somebody here is very very obsessed i feel like somebody here is a liar as well because the seven of swords came out in the other deck it's and it's here again with the deception card and the devil card came out in this deck and it's here again with codependent so somebody's obsessed with someone sexually as well highly attracted to them And they're hoping that this person keeps an open mind and that they will uh, give them another chance or be with them. We have unrequited love. Okay. And then we have passion. So there's a lot of passion here. And then we have religious factors in reverse and free yourself. So somebody's getting a divorce. All right. Yeah, we have unrequited love here and passion. Lots of passion and attraction here. What's the messages here for Pisces? What's the message here for Pisces? Pisces. We have paradise. All right. This is happiness, expansion, joy, playfulness, oneness, enjoying each other. Yeah. And we have passion here again. So a lot of passion. All right. Insane chemistry, like each other, equally having fun. Yeah, a lot of passion here and a lot of attraction and photograph. Looking at your photos, missing you, nostalgia, make new memories. And then we have kisses at the bottom and Cupid's arrow. So this is definitely something new. Okay. And somebody wants to build and, and travel to see you. Okay. Yeah, falling in love. I feel like somebody misses kissing you and falling in love and being with you and, and all of this. Okay. So those are the messages I have for you, um, Pisces. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share this video. And if you would like a personal, that information is down in the description box.